Hey guys, so I'm going to be sharing with you the first grocery haul out of November's budget. Okay, I'm gonna start out showing you the diapers. I separate out groceries and um, kind of household items. I, I throw baby stuff into that category. Um, this box of diapers at Hy-Vee after tax was $26.36. We got uh, 30 cents fuel saver for buying the diapers and then we have a $3 rebate on Ibotta, and um, I got back just over, the equivalent of just over $3 on um, Fetch Rewards app. So there was that. And uh, there was a dollar printable coupon um, on this. I just forgot it. So that was coupon fail. Anyway. Okay, so here is what we bought, at least at Hy-Vee and Aldi. After this, I'll show you Dollar General. But we'll start here at Hy-Vee. We spent a total of right there, forty-five dollars and fifty-four cents on food. Go right here. Peanut butter we purchased for ninety-nine cents a piece, and it was a limit of two, so we bought that. I got two cans of chili beans. They were fifty cents a piece. Um, we're baking chili tonight, and we just needed some more beans with it. Uh, purchased two bags of these Hy-Vee corn chips and those were I forgot how much those were uh -uh. those were a dollar a piece it ended up being slightly less at Aldi but we got them at Hy-Vee for a dollar a piece and then my husband is obsessed with eggnog so we his first eggnog of the season and that was $2.99 that's I think that's the most expensive thing we bought <laughs> was the eggnog okay and then we bought some baking supplies the sugar I got two bags of sugar and those were 99 cents a piece I got this one bag of flour this is a five pound bag and that was a dollar 59 ended up being an amazing deal at Aldi for flour so after we went there Vinegar was 99 cents. The brown sugar, I believe it was $1.18. Let me double check that. Yes, $1.18 on the two bags of brown sugar. We got 20 containers of yogurt for 29 cents a piece. I picked up head butter, so I picked up some margarine. This was 69 cents for the pack. Got some spinach for a dollar. The grapes, I got two bags of grapes over here for 88 cents a pound. We have three bunches of bananas. So those were 39 cents a pound. I picked up this one little box of spaghetti for a dollar. So kind of expensive, I guess, for pasta. Uh, there was a penny fuel saver on that. Picked up this little box of freezer storage bags. There's only 12 bags in here, but it was 59 cents. We have the potatoes back here. I got two five pound bags of potatoes. Those were 99 cents a piece. And then we purchased garlic bread. This was $2.69 for this. I almost forgot. Little section here. I got two packages of bacon. It was on sale for $1.99. Uh, there was no limit, but I don't have a lot of freezer space, so I got two of those at that price. And then I picked up some extra vegetables. These are 77 cents a piece. So I just grabbed four of those. I just kind of keep our veggie stock going. Okay, on to Aldi. Stocked up on flour at Aldi. So spent a total of $37.64. And that includes purchasing two bags. So I ended up using all the bags we had at Hy-Vee when we went. And we needed a lot of our bags are being trashed anyway. So now we have two nice big Aldi bags right, right there, actually. Okay. So we will start here. The saltine crackers were 75 cents a piece. I got two boxes of those. Got this little package of crackers and for Riker to have a snack during the week. And those were da, 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 89 cents. Got two dozen eggs. I believe those are 58 cents a piece. Find them on here. Yes, large eggs are 58 cents a piece. One head of lettuce for our Taco night. The corn chips were for taco salad, by the way, and for um, if anybody wants them with chili. The iceberg lettuce was $1.29. Milk, we purchased some whole milk for, where is it on my receipt here? There it is, $2.92. Bread, we got two loaves of bread for $0.85 cents a piece. 
We purchased two bags of Gala apples. Um, I believe these are three pound bags. Yeah, three pounds. And those were $1.39. Double check that. Yeah, $1.39 per bag. So that was a good deal. Picked up some squash. This is kind of a surprise deal for me. These were 39 cents per pound. So I got three acorn squash. We'll have stuffed squash um, either this week or next week. And then I picked up a butternut squash to do like a butternut mac and cheese dinner one night. Okay, I got two containers of spaghetti sauce. One we'll use for spaghetti, the other I'm going to make a tortellini soup. I'll use the other jar in that. Those are 85 cents a piece. Picked up some mild cheddar for $1.69. Uh, pork sausage was $1.89. I was going to get it at high V because they had sausage three for three dollars. That was totally gone. So when I got that, taco seasoning was 29 cents, I believe. Double check that really quickly. 39 cents, excuse me. And then I got two packages of the tortellini. Usually use about a package and a half in the soup recipe. And I think those were $1.49 a piece, they were. Now we'll get to the flour. I am stocked on flour. These, I got to Aldi and their flour was priced for five pound bags at 99 cents a bag. So I'm going to stock my pantry. And that is how I end up saving money in the long run. Like when something is super cheap, I pick it up at that price. So yeah, this week it was baking items and probably for several weeks, baking items and then turkey and ham. But here is, yeah, Aldi and Heidi. All right, and here is what I picked up at Dollar General, just some things we were needing for the house. We were needing um, something for our recyclables. We've been using um, our cardboard boxes from moving and we're um, we about ran through those. So we got a, a tub that we can put all of our recyclables in. Um, I picked up some finished dish tabs. I picked up two of these because I had a digital Dollar General coupon. I was supposed to make these buy one, get one free. It did not apply, so that ended up being a fail, but we need dishwasher stuff anyway. Those were $5.50 a piece. This tub was $6.50. Um, we needed some trash bags, so I picked this one up, and that was $7 for $54, so not too bad. We needed diaper wipes, of course, so that right there. Some diaper wipes, and those were $5.95. And then I also got back... Um, 59 points of my Fetch Rewards app. For those, I just picked up some hot chocolate just to have some for um, watching movies and stuff in the evenings with the kids. So we got a marshmallow kind and then just a regular kind. And they were $1.70 per box. And then we were just needing a little broom. So we just got this little bitty dollar broom. We only have um, the kitchen floor, which is not really large, and then our bathrooms. So. That is what we got as far as our household uh, necessities, I guess, and then just something for fun. So, total was $32.14. Um, the 5 off 25 did apply, but that did not. So that was a bummer, but yeah, we got some stuff we needed. Okay, and here is our meal plan for the week uh, using some of what we purchased and some of what we had on hand. So Sunday is gonna be shepherd's pie. Monday, tortellini soup. Tuesday is gonna be chicken tacos, actually like chicken taco salad. Wednesday is gonna be spaghetti and garlic bread. Thursday, pork roast, potatoes and carrots. I don't have any carrots, so it's gonna be carrots and, or potatoes and one of the frozen vegetables. Friday is gonna be tortellini soup. And then Saturday, I'm going to do a squashy bacon mac and cheese. Now, I think I said tortellini soup twice. Friday's not tortellini, it's chicken tortilla. Tortellini's up here. So I'm gonna have two soups. Tortellini soup and then chicken tortilla. 